Hi YouTube! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Leslie and I hope you are all having a wonderful day today. I am very excited for today's video because I've actually been working on this video for probably a month. So by the title of this video, I'm sure you already know what it is. It is a thrifting haul and I've honestly been thrifting probably for about a year now. Uh, one, because I'm broke. Two, because, you know, we're trying to save the planet and we're trying to be more sustainable. So, also, I realized that thrifting, I mean, by when thrifting, I usually tend to find some really good items and they're actually better than what you would find today. Um, especially if you're trying to get into fashion. So, first, we'll start off with the bottoms. For me, bottoms are a little bit more harder, whether it's thrifting or just buying brand new. Um, just because I'm really short and I don't know. Maybe my measurements are just kind of weird, but if I find something that fits me on my waist, it's either too long and if it fits me lengthwise correctly, it's like the waist is like super big or super small. So it's always very difficult, but I've been lucky enough to find some really cool items. Um, and the first one being a maxi skirt. Oh, well, a really medium length skirt. So, I actually purchased this one. So, all of this is thrifted, obviously. I would say the prices, but I honestly don't know the prices. I would say that this costs, like, honestly, just a few bucks. Um, but, yeah. So, the first item is this really medium long skirt. It's from Gap. You can see the Gap in here. And it has, like, a stretchy thingy. And then it has back and front pockets which i obviously love and this is real denim but it's also very comfortable and it has a little bit of like you know that like vintage look where it's all like scratched up and honestly i've worn this maybe like five times already and i just love it second item is this calvin klein jeans i'm not really a designer type of person whether it be like calvin klein or gucci or louis vuitton or supreme but I really like these jeans because it has a painting on the back. My video got cut off, but I don't know if someone drew this or if that's how the jeans were originally designed. But it has a painting of a sunflower. And if you know me, I love sunflowers. But honestly, you can tell that it's been used because, like, you know, this thing tag. And yeah, they're just ripped jeans. We love ripped jeans, but they're also, um,. I think they're like boyfriend jeans because they're like a little bit loose but they do fit me a little big so I tend to like fold them on my waist because if not they fall and we don't want to see my choninos okay now we'll start with the oh no wait one more um this another maxi brown medium skirt has buttons down in pockets in the back and in the front obviously and this is by the brand let's see i don't think this is a brand item it's called kabi but i really like it because it's soft and long okay now on to the tops we're usually more lucky with the tops so i found this green kami blouse whatever you may call it it's just a green basic Nothing special, but for me, it's really soft, and I just love this color. I've also been wearing it a ton lately. But one of my favorite items, I've been looking for one just exactly like this. Also, I have, like, nothing red on my closet, like, literally nothing red. So this was perfect. I've been looking for this type of sweaters for probably two years now. But usually, they sell are sold them for, like, 80 bucks. So I'm not paying 80 bucks for this. But I found this red, um hoodie it's not a hoodie it's a sweatshirt a sweatshirt and all of this and it says um old navy trademark new york san francisco establishing 94 and it's all stitched in you know and i just love this and super super soft i've worn this already and this one i did in third but i actually found in like a box in my house and i am very excited to wear this one it is, let me zip it up because it's not zipped up. You know, I like showing you guys stuff when it's like right out of my closet. Like if it's unzipped or unbuttoned, 
Like, it just doesn't look the same, you know what I mean? The sweater is like, wow. And then it comes with pockets. I just love that it's all white, fluffy, and soft, both on the inside and the outside. And it also has this gray and pink touch. Favorite colors. And so soft. Did I ever say that already? I think I said that already. I get really excited when I find clothing cheap and that it's actually, you know, it does its purpose. It's soft. This one. I love this one's a little bit too big. I might actually give it to my dad honestly because it's a little too big for me. But that was pretty cool. It's also super super soft on the inside. And it comes with pockets, also soft, and that's what it looks like from the back. Honestly, I would do super soft because it's obviously a fall slash winter haul. So everything's gonna be like sweaters. This another this is by a Korean brand. I was so excited when I found this. I saw like three people around it and I was like, nobody's getting it? I was like, what? It's like so soft. Like you can see it from far away. And also this is, the letters are stitched in as well as, as, well as all of this. It says Geoleak. Um, oh, and it has these which you can adjust the hoodie. And then at the bottom on the waist, you also have these to adjust the waist size. So you are able to keep like the cold out of like, you know, your body. I'm so excited for this one, but I haven't worn it. And it comes with obviously um, pockets. That's what it looks like from the back. Yeah, so I saw like three people around it, and I was like, nobody's gonna get that. Like, I want it. So I literally went in there and just snatched. I was like, it's mine now. Oh, I forgot to show you guys my sweater that I'm wearing right now. It's actually thrifted. But moving on, this one is. It's given Y2K, guys. It's given Y2K. And it comes with pockets, zipper, everything works perfectly fine. It really gives the Y2K vibes. I used to have one like this without this design, but it was actually black and I would wear it every single time. Um, but then I grew out of it and I couldn't wear it anymore and it was also kind of ripped because I wore it so many times. So purchased another one because you know they were kind of out of style by then but it's okay because we found one and then this one it's so soft if you guys could just touch it and also so this is a guy's jacket um if you know me i usually wear guys clothing because it's more affordable more comfy and fits me really big and i like you know loose fit but this one like the buttons are just like they snatched and it also comes with pockets, and this one just fits perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And that's the back. You know, you always gotta have a flannel if, for the winter or fall. Especially in California, that's like an essential. And then I found this really old vintage dress. It says Vintage Blue. Found it in 1969. Wow. And it comes with like a ribbon on the sides and this big pocket but it's just a denim dress that I am excited to wear I haven't worn it maybe tomorrow maybe we should wear this tomorrow then but yeah oh now I can show you guys my outfit that I'm wearing I'm not gonna show you guys now my sweater that I'm wearing so this is the outfit we're not doing an outfit check because I'm wearing shorts it's grumpy and it's actually a Disney last sweater and it comes with pockets and it comes with elbow patches and this is what the back looks like. Honestly, it's super comfy. Like I said, it's currently like 79 degrees, but in here it's a little bit more colder and honestly, I'm super comfy right now. Alrighty friends, well that is all for today's video. I was very excited to show you guys everything that I purchased so far and I'm very excited to sell these. So if you guys want to see more, feel free to follow me on my other socials. Um, like I said, thank you so much for watching and tuning in. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know what was your favorite item or if you have any ideas how I could style them, honestly send them my way because for some of them I still don't know. But I just know that I love them because they're super super soft. But anyways, um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure you t stay tuned for our next video. Um, the next one will probably be a part two that I am currently working on. 
If not, we'll see. Hmm. But also, if you want to check out some of the items that I've also purchased that are not in here, um, most of them will be accessories. Um, make sure you follow my Depop. Um, I usually post every Wednesday and Thursday. No. Wednesday and Friday, I post new items, so if you're interested in those, um, feel free to check them out. Anyways, hope everybody has a good rest of your day.